Magical Mike Pacers are all in behind the gate. The gate swings into the stretch, and here they come for the Magical Mike. They're off and pacing that Soho, going right out to grab the racetrack. Racing second, Peruvian Hanover on the inside. As they race into the turn, Royal Majesty pacing third. Artesian gets away fourth. All-American captor is fifth. Racing to the backside. Now sixth, Glorious Boys racing seventh. Down the backside, Life Sizzles. Up on the outside, Mount Palm Mark. Treading the field, coast to coast, Yankee. Opening quarter, 26 and one. Here to the turn, going to the 3 8 mark. On the outside, Peruvian Hanover and Ron Pierce grab the racetrack. Soho racing second. Royal Majesty pacing third. Racing fourth, Artesian. Tips to the outside, will follow the cover from Royal Majesty. Coming to the halfway point. It's Peruvian Hanover, the leader. Royal Majesty charging up on the outside. At the half, 54 and 3, 28 and 2. Second quarter, and they're going at it. The end of the turn in the 5 8. Peruvian Hanover on the inside. Royal Majesty on the outside, second. Soho racing third. Down the backside, All American capture is fourth. Three wide, Life Sizzles now fifth. Artesian between horses. Going to the three quarter mark. Royal Majesty sticks ahead in front. Peruvian Hanover on the outside. Soho right there, third. Three quarters, 121 and four. 27 and 1, backside, a little more than an 8 to go, Royal Majesty, and here comes Soho, on the move on the outside, Peruvian Hanover third, down the stretch they come, Royal Majesty, Soho closing on the outside, Royal Majesty and John Campbell win the magical mic, 150 flat. Just a gigantic effort by Royal Majesty. Uh, got away third, had to go first over, was outside much of the way, and draws off to win it in 150 flat. That race went completely different than I expected it to. Uh, Royal Majesty didn't get off the gate good at all, and uh, he actually looked a little floppy gated in the first turn. Campbell ducked and was going to wait for the dust to settle. When he went to make his move, Pierce pulled right out of the two hole and went to the front, retaking look from at, uh, Royal Majesty. And just an unbelievable season. Over 633,000 in the bank this year. He has a million four career earnings, a record of 148 and four, and. Uh, his last effort in an open pace just to get a tightener to come here was pretty good. 150 and two second in the Canadian pacing derby. Uh, basically yeah. what hurt him the most was the uh, Breeders Crown in that right. speed duel. speed duel. That's three hundred thousand dollar plus races on half mile tracks this year. He's really a half mile specialist to say the least. John Campbell moves back into a tie with David Miller. Well, the winningest driver here at the Delaware County Fair each with one hundred twenty eight wins in their careers here at Delaware. Royal Majesty, over the Brady Racing Stable in John Rizzo of New Jersey, Nat Vardy, the trainer, John Campbell in the sulky, five-year-old staff of Matt Scooter, Lady Hathaway, national season record, aged pacing stallion on a half-mile track. Mr. Toretti from Chip Thompson. Bill, on behalf of Tom Walsh, who has done so much for harness racing in Delaware, I want to congratulate you. Thank you very much. Good meeting. Mr. Peretti, Royal Majesty, who's at his top of his game today. Unbelievable, huh? Wow. Good. Super factor payoff, a cool $67 even. 2-4 per 11.40, 2-4-1 try, paid 28.60.